Good day, my little teacups. Would you like to join me on an adventure? Well, with an adventure that's sort of midway in progress, this is the part two of my recent run of the Binding of Isaac Aftermath. Yes. So, let's go, shall we? Last time, we were the lost. Then, through a series of very unfortunate events, we got accidentally transformed into question mark, question mark, question mark. Wait for it. Dude. Eh, never mind. I can't be bothered. What? What's that card? Ooh, the Empress. Ooh, I should not have passed that up. I've walked the wrong way. No, 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 no. Don't want that. Thank you. There's the this boss room is not here. Fuck. Now, yes, for those of you who are uninitiated, this is part two of a run that I started a while ago. And this is for a fan submitted seed. Now, thank you very much again to Scout Nation for that. Uh, yeah, sorry. No oh, bollocks. Let me through the door. But, uh, yes, so I... Apparently, there's something very interesting in the boss rush. So that's why I'm going quite as fast as I am. Mm, and... Yeah! Well, that did a little something, anyway. Oh, God. You got myself killed there. No, no, no. Come back, Hollow. Come back. You're the one who screwed me up when I was the lost. Little dick. Oh, right then. I suppose I might as well test and see if it's down here, mightn't we? Come on, audience, it's an adventure to find the boss room in time. What floor are we actually on? Depth one. So we're going to need to get through this floor and the next in the next five or so minutes. Fair dues. The boss room is not here. Well, this was a bad idea. Uh, and I'm dead. Okay. I'll be... I'll be back with you in a moment, audience, when I've started this properly. And we're back. Thank you for waiting. Now, in this parallel universe version of the Binding of Isaac Run, we are playing as... Well, we started off as Lilith this time, rather than Lost, because, well, I'm not doing that again. But instead, we picked up the Judas's shadow, rather than the Ankh. Now, I've died again to the horn, uh, sorry, the hollow, as could be expected. And so, here I am, as Judas's shadow. Yes, on the very same run still, though, so we know exactly what to expect from sudden rooms. And my god, my damage! Holy hell! It's incredible. Absolutely incredible! Whoa, 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 what are you doing? Stop that, stop that, stop that. Damn it, game! Wait a minute, I've already been this way. I've already opened that chest, I know. Why am I still here? Why am I still here? Ooh, chest, I can't resist. It's shiny! I'm a goddamn magpie at this point. Yep, gotcha. And, oh, this damage is fantastic. Yes. So, um, yes, something I didn't actually know, audience, just in case um, you're interested in this kind of information. Um, if you start as Lilith, but have one of those objects that means when you die, you come back as somebody else. Well, it turns out when you come back, you won't have Incubus anymore. I didn't know this. I thought I was going to have Incubus and be Judas's shadow, but no. Instead, it's turned my tears into being just straight up tears, which I'm actually happier with. I'd rather be able to shoot out of my actual eyes than, like, using a follower. Ow. Ow, game. Ow. Secret room? Nope, nope, nope. Nothing there. Fair enough. So we're... We're living, living on a prayer right now. Whoa, as Bon Jovi would say. We've got one heart left, but I'm sure that'll be absolutely fine. Oop, treasure room. That is... Pisces, which is knockback. No, 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 no. I'm not having it. No. Uh, don't think number one's really useful. Um... 
I really want that. I really want that, but it's just gonna make things weird with what's coming up next. So, no. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to- I never thought I'd do this, but I'm gonna have to pass up epic fetus. And out, 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 the sun is, uh, wow! The sun has really had a bit of a, a flare and is glaring through my window. I can't see anything. I think there's some spikes there. Well, you could not say, audience, this has become a blind run. Okay. Uh, hmm. This is really not so good, actually. Uh, well, it's an adventure. I can't exactly get up and tweak it right now. I'm kind of busy. Hang on a minute. Ah. Oh, I can see again. Ah, oh. I can also see that I only have half a heart and shit, it's enemies that jump. Oh no, I'm probably going to die. I'm dead. <sighs> right, no, no, I'm, I'm not doing it. I'm not giving up, but I'm not playing Lilith this time. This time, we're going to make things unusual. We're going to make our damage through the damn roof. Eve mode. It really is you win some, you lose some, isn't it, audience? I've closed the window, so now I can't have the sun glaring in my eyes, which is a fantastic bonus. Unfortunately, this is at the side effect that I now can't see my stopwatch either. Ah. Well, we need to lower our health anyway, so bump into him. What a horrible night to have a curse. There we go. That's what I like to see. Get some... Ah, oh, for God's sake. Right, so here we go. Uh, frame rate chug. No, no, the frame rate. Shit. Okay, okay. We're fine. We're fine. It's back. This isn't going to go too wrong, and any damage we take is just going towards the Hall of Babylon curse anyway. Oh, come on. Just die. Thank you. Really? Eve, your damage is awful when you're not in demon mode. It really is. I know I'm on hard mode and all, but really? Girl. Holy shit, you're fast. Why are you so fast? What? Uh, right then, why am I human? I, I I can't see how much health I have, and it's really annoying. Whoop, whoops. There we go, got the cast back. I'll take you on. I'll take you on with one hand, one hand. Time to hide my back. Of course I lose, but yes. Let's go. Yeah. You just annihilated yourself there, dude. I had no part in that. Blasty, blasty, blasty. Shooty, shooty, dead. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. I don't think I ever knew what I was saying. Why do you watch this? I don't know. <laughs> I don't say anything that means anything. Oh, but I love it. <laughs> okay there, game. That was a little, little bit closer than I'd like. Thank you. Bust this open. Die, 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 die. Now, chances are we'll lose out on that spectral baby. Or not. Okay, then. Um. Well, I'll take these. And hell, I'll, sure, I'll take that. It means I don't have a problem when it comes to the um, whole Curse of Babylon thing. Yes. I can smell tuna. I can smell tuna very strongly. Someone in the kitchen is doing tuna. Oh, no, 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 you don't. No. What the hell was that noise? <laughs> what noises did I just manage to... Excuse me, did you... What happened there? Why did my bullets bend back on themselves? You saw that, right, audience? Oh no, the frame rate! No! 
Why is this a thing? Okay. It, it's back, I guess. Chargy bastards. Come on! I'll deal with you. Come on. I've got quad shot and I'm not afraid to use it. Bucket of lard. No, thank you. Judgment. Blow you up. Thank you. Money. Don't really need any of that. Go through here. Slingshot around you. Alright then. We're getting close. We're getting close, sir. Anyway. Oh, you bastards. That's what I like to see. That's not what I like to see. That's definitely not what I like to see. I'm going to make a detour. <laughs> we're, we're going to get some health audience. Yes, we are. Now we're not quite in such danger of imminent and violent death. Frame rate. No. Uh, okay. There's the golden poo. We know we're on the right track now. I'm starting to get worried. I thought I'd missed the golden poo somehow. You elusive shit. There we go. Right, now we're gonna get the Judas's shadow, because hell yeah, I'm not turning down Judas's shadow. You mad? Thank you, Judas's shadow. Then head down here, down here. Ow! I ran into that. I'm an idiot. This isn't the room I thought it was. Whoops. This is the room I thought of. Frame rate, really? It's the binding of Isaac. Come on. Computer, how can you not run the binding of Isaac? Look at it. I mean, look at it. Alright then, uh, let's try and take on Krampus, I suppose. Come on, Krampus! Oh no, no! Why would you do the rotating version of your bloody laser attack in a- I don't see how I was supposed to survive that. I'm just going to pick this up and move on. Fuck you, Krampus. Fuck you! You malodorous pile of tripe. Of a boss. And I walked into that. It's like I see the projectile is about to miss me, and I, I feel bad for them, so I have to walk into it. I'm an idiot. I really am. I'm just starting to come to that realization. I mean, I know I was dumb, but I am catastrophically dumb. Number one, no. I still have to pass up epic features. Why? Shoop the whoop. Hell no. Oh, that's terrible. Oh, fine. Come on. Come along, brother Bobby. Now we've got two followers. Oh, champion versions. Wonderful. You know what? When you gave me this seed, and you know who you are, you did not mention it was this difficult. Or am I just terrible? Actually, I think I'm just terrible. Okay, don't answer that question. Please don't answer that question. I refuse to die again. No. You bloody laser spiders. I keep forgetting you're there. And you freak the hell out of me every time I see you. Okay. You bastards killed me last time. No. There you go. You are not getting that chance a second time. I refuse. I refuse. Brownie. Oh, I've never actually fought you before. Except outside, except in the boss rush. And maybe sometimes greed mode, but never in the actual game. You are a very strange boss. I'm, I'm assuming that Edmund McMillan, creator of this game, at some point was uh, terrorized involving Pooh. Because Pooh turns up an awful lot in this game. Okay, Curse of the Blind. Lovely. So I could pick up something that completely bones the run and not even know. 
Uh, oh, really? Wait a minute, curse of the blind? How am I going to know what to pick up from the boss rush then? Because it gives you a choice. Oh no. I've just got I've just got a hope, haven't I? I've just got a hope that it's the right item. Okay, come on. Dad's Ooh. Oh That's actually quite useful right now, since I have no other usable Oh Nope. <laughs> Hell no. Not going in there. Not just yet. I want to try and find the shop. I didn't I didn't I didn't see there were spikes there. And I just blatantly walked straight onto them. That took concerted effort to walk like that onto them. But no. No, 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 no. OEM's a complete idiot. Around the spikes, thank you. Well, fair enough. I guess we don't really have much choice then, do we? It's into the boss room we go. Uh, whoa. Well, at least we have Whore of Babylon now. Oh, uh, why? Okay then. Okay. Can I even do this? I, I have no idea. I honestly have. What happened? I'm sorry, what? She what? Okay, I'm gonna need to go back and look at that near. Was there like a bomb there or something? Because I was nowhere near her foot. <sighs> I'm afraid this is going to have to be the end of the episode today, audience. I I have other things to do today, unfortunately, and I cannot take the time out to go through this one more time just for this episode. But I promise I will start another episode at some point, starting from Mother's Foot. <sighs> Finding Isaac, I I love you, but you can really piss a man off sometimes. Thank you very much for watching. Julian can't go. Thank you very much for watching, audience. I have been the over Englishman. This has been one epic fail of a Binding of Isaac episode. Please never forget to like the video, to comment, to subscribe to see even more failure. And please check out some of these beautiful people listed here. Love you all, and farewell.